Hi there. I'd like to show in this video that I met a significant problem with the um, synchronization of Octotrack MIDI and uh, modular system MIDI. The problem was that the Octotrack continuously sends a clock to the modular via MIDI even if the Octotrack is paused, not playing. So let me explain you where the problem is. We have the MIDI track here, we have some tricks. So I press play and we see on the Vermona what MIDI interface we see that some gates and notes coming on the channel 1 and channel 2 and at the same time the clock is running you see the green light when we play when we press stop here sorry we see that there are no gates and no cv coming into the modular but anyway the midi clock is running so i take the cable and i switch the clock out from the motor to Rene and we see that the clock is running even if we play press play or we press stop on octatrack the clock is still running how to solve this problem this problem is solving by the beautiful module of my friend making it is a Moto V Love, this guy from Russia, Zigluck. So what we have done? So I take the cable from the Octotrack MIDI out, and I put the cable inside the Zigluck. Then I take another cable another MIDI cable and I put it I put it in output of Z clock to the input of Vermona module which allows me to send the notes to the system Let's look what's happening now. So if we press now, if we press play on the Octotrack, the clock is receiving the clock via MIDI from Octotrack. You see the BPM and the clock is running. We see the same tricks and the same gates coming inside. We see the clock is running and we see also that the René is running. But if we press stop on the octa track, the clock is not running anymore and René stopped. So I press play on octa track, René is running and I press stop on octa track and René is stopped. So the problem is solved. This problem, this solution need a new version of the software for Zclock so make sure that you have the latest firmware upgraded let's take a look inside you see the menu here the constant clock is off so the constant clock should be off if we press it on, if we turn it on, it will be the same like before. So the constant clock from Octa will go through, but we don't need it. We need the Octa track play stop buttons to reflect the modular system. So the constant clock should be off. I hope this video is helpful. And uh, next time I will explain more about Z clock features. It has some useful features inside, like hold mode.
I need to find out more about this feature and I will explain you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.